Hello and welcome back. This is a new horror game I'm, I'm starting up called Stairs. Um, My name is Christopher Adams. Freelance journalist looking for a new story and someone to sell it to. Lately I've been looking into three missing people but with no luck. Valerie Berkeley, James Reed, and Jean Jowers Remens. Berkeley was allegedly kidnapped by the other two and is presumed dead. There was no ransom note, no exchange. All three simply went missing for three years. Until now. Police found the body of a young female yesterday in the old factory outside of town. According to my contact, it was Berkeley, killed by strangulation. So why would a kidnapping victim turn up dead three years later? Are Reed and Remen still involved somehow? I'm on my way to the factory now. If nothing else, I'll get some photos before anybody else does. That's how journalists do it. Ain't nobody else need to get these photos. I'm getting them first. Movement controlled with WAS. Ooh, this is pretty. Now this is done on the Unreal Engine. So we can run. This is actually really pretty. Look at the little details. I love little details in games. The creaking. Ooh. Jade, open journal. Notes, talk camera, take photo, interact. Not taken, taken, turn page. I found a way to the factory through a walking path. It should be close now. Okay, I'm gonna close it. Okay. Da -da -da. Ooh. It's a camera. Hang in. Very, very pretty for a, uh, an, uh, I'm assuming it's an indie game. It's not a AAA title as far as I'm aware of. Well, granted, you know, using the Unreal Engine is, uh, gives you a little bit of an edge. I mean, they have some really pretty stuff. I mean, look at all those. I can see my hand, and I can't do anything. Why well, give me the option to touch it if I can't touch it? Uh, Nidakra? Can I go in here? Can't even interact with that one. Okay, so I def I want to come up here first. It's police tape. So this place is uh, quarantined by the police. Normally meaning an investigation. Hazards. Can I climb? Can't jump. Okay, so I can't go that way. Poser. Yeah, I mean, it's just it's a lot of. I can't even read any of it. Oh, yeah, that's just convenient. They have a kind of control. No, I don't like control crouches. I got into the factory. The crime se scene should be closed. I should look around and take all the pictures I need. Okay. What about this picture of a... Uh... I hear you out there. Okay, so E interacts with objects. Okay. You can't just click it. getting suspenseful. Is something going to jump out at me? Am I going to get spooked? Or... Okay, they're in a circle. Why are they in a circle? Take a picture of that. That's kind of weird. Is this like a counseling center? And the circle just happens to have an opening to both doors. No, I didn't ever play this game. I haven't looked up any reviews. Um, guys? I'm in here. You don't have to lock me in.
I didn't read any reviews on it. I didn't really look into it a whole lot. I like kind of getting into, you know, the game looked interesting. Again, like I said, it, it really good as far as the details go. Gameplay, uh, I don't want to know. I, I like to go into a game semi, you know, cold. Meaning I, I don't like knowing a whole lot about the game before I get into it. I mean, there are games that obviously you, you're going to know a little bit about, but games like this one. I got it because it was on. It's on Steam. It wasn't expensive. I mean, I think they had it on sale, and it, it looked good. So. I mean, that's kind of the trifecta for me. It's inexpensive. Uh, no. There's nothing here. Okay. That looks important. No blood is signs of a fight. Why strangle her out here, or did they ha did they move the body? Yeah. Okay, so I'm assuming that looks it's pointing. So I'm assuming, as a freelance journalist, I'm interested in what's going on with this case, and I either assume that it is dirty, meaning the cops are hiding something, or this guy is drum. Uh, looks Russian. Oh, yay. Yeah, let, let's, let's go underground. I hate underground. It's not like I'm, I guess I'm not really afraid of underground, but I know what video games do to you underground. Fox, no. Give me a hammer. Pick. Okay, no, get you. I don't like the idea of skipping anything, but I can't really move it in here for me, anyways. In we go. That looks like maybe a generator room. Man, it's dark. I literally, uh, you know, I can't see anything. Oh, hey, I got a little bit of night vision with this. Nothing here. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go into deeper stairs. That's just where I'm at. I do like playing these uh, horror games because a lot of times ones like these that are not so mainstream have really good stories and the story is always what draws me into the game uh, it just okay it's a loading okay but yeah the story I mean I don't know what's going on here all I know is I'm a journalist investigating this murder and why I'm going down these stairs after looking at the body and I don't know but the story on these tend to Either be really, really good. Oh, way, way out there. Sorry, I haven't had any coffee today. And I'm like, I'm like dragging right now. But the stories are either really good or really, really bad. And either side of that can be entertaining. Um, like I said, this one graphically looks good. I heard that. Um, I found some sort of underground installation beneath the factory and I hear a crying person but can't see anything where are you maybe it's not maybe that drawing of, you know that, uh, outline is a girl who's not really dead who are you I don't Hello? know. Who's there? How can you hear me? My name's Valerie. I've been locked in here. You have to help me. Um, are you locked in the vent? I, I don't think so. I have to help you. Why do I have to help you? I think I have to leave now. A, B, C, D, E, F. Okay. Um, 
Magna Safe 5000. In order to operate Magna Safe 5000, you will need to set a number combination to open it. This is done by aligning the number dials with the corresponding letter to form a combination. That is easily remembered. Okay, so one, two, three. Does it? Does that mean they? They wouldn't make it this simple, would they? I mean. No. Okay. So I'm assuming somewhere there's a combination. There's a med kit there. I'm in here! The key to the door is in that safe. Find the combination and you can set us both free. <laughs> us both? Free. I renovated the room in the basement well before. If I'm going to do this, it should be done here, where I can be in control. Uh, why do I feel like you're not really in control? I need to find the combination to the safe. It has to be around here somewhere. Does it? Um. Oh, there she is. There's a one-way mirror. Friends came over to see her today. Stayed for hours in her room until I asked them to leave. She was getting a bit too excited. So why is he trying to isolate her and, uh, I mean, locking her in a room by herself with nothing else? I can't go that way. In the combination, I would assume... God. I hate to move further into this place, but... I mean, That's the kitchen. He spends a lot of time in there when he's finished with me. Well, what does he do with you? You know what, scratch it. I don't want to know. Bathroom. Oh, bathrooms. Okay. I don't like bathrooms a whole lot. This looks like a study. Schizophrenia, psychology of schizophrenia, psychotherapy and schizophrenia, child schizophrenia. I think he thinks she has schizophrenia. Modern psychology, tragedy and cathar catharsis, the psychology of Aristotle. That's going way back. Okay. C, bookshelf row, F, edition of book. Okay, I have a feeling I'm going to need a piece of paper. Okay, so C. Probably that two. Uh, yeah. I'm not great at remembering things like this, so I will write it down. Two. Um, and then it says edition of book. Any of these actually say what edition they are? Third edition. I wonder if that's, see that says first edition, second edition, first edition. F equals edition of book. C equals bookshelf row. I have plenty of space on my desk. I just put too much junk in here. Man.
Uh, oh well, I'll figure it out. Okay, so... Clinical Psychology 2nd Edition. Uh, okay, so is that... Clinical Psychology 2nd Edition. Okay, so that figure. Okay, so I need to find clinical psychology on here. And whatever shelf. Okay, so it's that one. Okay, so that fix that figures out these. So bookshelf row, an edition of book. So it's clinical psychology. So let's see, A, B, C, D, E, and F. That's second edition the bookshelf row that that was on is a second. So that's two. Okay, so they're gonna make me like literally go through this whole place. I don't, I don't do that. Okay, so they're gonna make me literally like go through this thing. she doing? I mean, she looks weird. I mean, she doesn't... The proportions seem off. Okay, so I'm assuming I'm probably gonna have to go down here now. Dad has some kind of archive down there for his research. There has to be something down there. Hurry! I have a feeling that Dad may not be the issue. I'm thinking this is all build-up. I think I'm gonna let her out she's crazy what is this or dad is completely crazy I, I'm kind of all over the place with it right now I don't know what to think or truly where to go I'm not time on this episode I'm not sure how long I've been here it has become a routine. He does the same things to me every day. I guess you could always go up there and just kind of you know, mess with it until I find him. Same things to you every day, but you're not really telling me what he does. Whoa. equipment or blood pressure 90 over 60 after risperidone we'll change diet hopefully vasopressors won't be necessary caffeine caffeine i i'm a with you a thousand percent on that caffeine i don't know if I'll, i don't want to go down here um hello can you can you can you not stand there like a Really scary doll. Can't go that way. It's really bad, is it? Like, it's hard to see, and I don't know. If, I, I'm sure I probably have my. Uh, I, mean, I keep it kind of low. This is creepy. Okay, box in front of this one. Hello, shadow figure. Where are you? It's just there. I don't know what it is. Or what I can do with it. There. I feel like I'm going way too far into this. You need to hurry. I don't know what he'll do when he finds you. When? Same, uh, same looking thing. I have a feeling he's already found me. He's just waiting to see what I'm gonna do. It's my opinion. Man, I don't know. Am I missing something? Oh, obviously missing. Uh, 
not feeling so good, Dad. Feeling like people are trying to get to me, to hurt me, and kill me. I try not to get scared sometimes. It's so scary, the table's sweating. You wanna know? Well, when the light passes through the atmosphere, it connects twice. And that makes the light inflect, and it can be reduced to a single atom, and... What is she talking about? Okay. The way this place is built makes me think that it's a, uh... Literally gonna have something chasing me through here. I say literally like it's not. Like there's a figurative to it. It's funny as I'm a little tense, but nothing's happened really. I mean, I'm just running around hitting doors. Dark, I'm underground. I really don't know what I'm looking for here. If I can't do, then I can. Okay, so this game definitely sets an atmosphere. I mean, it puts you on edge, but. I could literally just I'm gonna pause it if I know how to open. Did she really be Valerie? In that case, who died in the factory if Valerie is down here? Oh, uh, I don't think that's Valerie.
idea if any of this even means anything. This when you guys probably think you guys are probably screaming about the stuff that I'm supposed to be doing and all the stuff I'm missing. She did not take to her new room well. Swelling will go down in a day or two. What did you do to her? Sounds like you like beat her. You're trapped here, just like me, Mr. Adams. How do you know my name? I never we told need to help each other, Mr. Adams. Don't you want to help me? That's a little blatant, but we'll take them. Four, seven. There's still two more numbers that I'm missing. I think I've got four of the numbers now. The last thing you need is in the storage room, behind the green door. Hurry up before he gets back. Um, how did that key get there? Okay, lady. I don't know what you're doing, but don't hump. You're already creepy. None of the doors are open. I don't know what I need in here. Oh, I think I'm about to get jumped. I will be free. Isn't that what you wanted, Mr. Adams? So sure anymore. What did you do? What do you think about the last thing I need is in there? Then you take the key?
Hey, I'm like completely missing something. I'm enough to make a guess here or not. exactly how the game intended me to do it I'm sure but that worked I got a key I can't look at it I got no idea what it goes to oh wait you know I know what it goes to Let's see what it's supposed to do here. She's gone. Oh, come on. Really? She locked me in here. interesting okay well with that I'm going to go ahead and end this episode there we will pick up at this point in the next episode is there a save no it auto saves we'll pick up at this point in the next episode thank you guys for watching that has been an interesting one I'm kind of starting to get a feel for the way this game's gonna play so I kind of I'm getting it I'm liking it a little bit more now I think after this it's going to get really interesting well, thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed, hit that like button. Oh. Excuse me, sorry. Next time I'm going to have my coffee before I record, so I'll be in a bit, bit more of a... Hey. Shh. Be in a bit better, bit, bit, bit more of upbeat, I think. I'll, I'll be able to do a little bit better. But I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Have a good one.